quick update you two on the box just about got it put back together you see i got the front gotta put my bell up, up top all the one of those most of all got my molding up top gotta put my windows back in and then do my uh window trim and all that got my rocker panel molding on I got the chrome door handles on. I changed this lock out here. Put a brand new chrome in there on both sides. My rear on. Finna install my lights in the back now. Finna attach my clips here. Mount that up. Coming along. Got the auto clips also for that real windshield. So I can put that molding on it. I, I got that trim all also. Need all my bezel to go here. Emblems that go here. I'm gonna clean up that bump a little bit more. Order me some uh, rubber fillings for that also. Uh, YouTube back with some more video content I get these leaves and stuff off my car from it being outside too long it's fall so all the leaves gonna be falling on, on the car unless it's in here all right so what we're gonna do we're gonna put these window seals in in the inside. We're going to put the inside seals in on all four doors, all right? All right. Just came in to the mail. Brand new seals. One pack contains two. So that may be front door like that, them, those look bigger. And these may be real. All right. So now we're gonna go over here, we're gonna get these pieces. There's one, two. From the rear window, we gotta put that in. We're gonna put all four of these in. I gotta find my fourth one. Should be in here. All right. So anyway, what we're gonna do, we're gonna take these windows back out. Probably leave them out this time because once my outer window sweep arrive I put those on those chrome pieces that goes here put those on then I put my inner end with my uh, my door uh, installation as well and when I be finished with it I have to do it only one time huh right. so I'm gonna find somewhere to set this camera down that way you can uh, see me put it in I guess I can show my face for <laughs> since I don't get to do that most most of the time because I'm holding the camera. All right, so I'm gonna find somewhere to put this and I'll uh, cut it back on. As always, I couldn't find nowhere to put that stand, so I went ahead and dropped the one out and disconnected this Phillips head screw, this 10 millimeter bolt that goes here, and this 10 millimeter bolt that goes here. 
All right, so that's gonna slide this piece right here out. And I can pull that one out and I can put my seal right down from the top in here. All right, and put all that together in one piece. All right, so we're gonna do it like this. Pull it out. That stays with the window. All right, just like this window right here. Now we can pull this piece out. in here. I gotta put all that back together also. Yeah, it's mine, so it's gonna take a little time. All right, so I'm gonna open up the package of seal and I'm gonna uh, get it prepped. I'm gonna have to pull these little tabs right here up so that come out this rubber piece, throw that rubber piece away and I used that silver piece and put it with the new seal. Then we'll slide it right back in. All right, give me a minute, let me prep that out and I'll cut you back on. All right, so basically you wanna take the new one, put this thing in the middle up top of that very, this corner piece right here, it goes to the very top of that and push it through these rubber ends and fold those tabs back across that rubber. It's gonna go in just like this. All right, let's put that uh, small piece back up there. I'm gonna put that little one back in again first. So we know what we're working with. She is up against that pretty, pretty tight. All right. So now we're gonna take this piece here. We're gonna slide that, this rubber piece all the way down in there. All the way down to the bottom. All right, so I'm gonna do that. Then we'll uh, cut the camera back on when we start back installing it. All right, so we got that rubber piece in. Slid it through that channel that's, that's on the window, the chrome channel thing. So what I done was spray it a little WD-40. Something to make that rubber slide, because that thing is, <laughs> Those new rubbers, you already know how they are. They, they're a little swell. They're not as used, so they, they don't, they're not flimsy. But anyway, that WD-40 helps it slide all the way in there. All right, so now we're gonna put it back in the car, and then we're gonna install the window. We'll connect the screws back together, and we close the door on it. All right, got one seal put in, Let's see it. Fit pretty good. All right, once I hook up my power back in the windows, it'll straighten out a lot because I'm gonna let that one up and down so that track can, could uh, groove that uh, seal. But I just got the one that's sitting here. I can screw the bolt back down in it. Because uh, as you recall me saying, I'm gonna leave that one down. So when I put my chrome here, and then my chrome around the windows itself. So that, that chrome gonna go right between now to kind of mold that against that window also. All right. <clears throat> All 
All right, good people. Just cleaned up my uh, window trim chrome here. I'm gonna polish it a little bit. And then I'm gonna put my window sweeps in. I take them out, to, took them out the pack already. I uh, got my weather stripping in also. I gotta put that one on the uh, driver's side after I adjust that door. So this is my uh, rear window sweep. I'm going to put it in here. Put my trim go all the way around here also. I'm about to put that in now. And then hook this one up also. All right. Oh, you two. Finally got everything finished on the window. Got the trim around it. Got my... Uh, Window sweeps in here. All right, got my uh, weather stripping in. Got it on all four. About to put my uh, door pads back in now. Gotta put my rear trim on my windshield there. I have to trim already. I'm just gonna give me a new windshield first. That way I can put my clips in. Whoever done this, uh, put glue all around the side of it. Well, you can't put the clips on there. So I'm gonna get professionals to do that. All right, got my window trim around that. Windows also. I gotta put my drip rail here. That later, but must be good luck for the car. All right, I got it all cleaned up. All shiny. So right now, about like I said, I'm gonna put my door pads in. I'm put my trim here also. I gotta get that trim. Put my door pads in and probably buff on the car a little more. There's some more clarity here. Let me go to work on that. And then once again, I cut it back on. Let's check it out. If you have any questions about anything, uh, comment down at the bottom. Let me know. Or if you have any tips about anything, comment at the bottom. Let me know also. I don't know everything. I'm just learning this process as I, as I do it. All right.